I'm a big fan of USB battery chargers since they can usually charge two at a time and USB is such a common power source available in so many different places. I have a bunch of them for my filming gear so it's nothing new really. However, when XStyle reached out to me to review their VN2 smart battery charger, I have to admit, at first I wasn't that interested, but when I took a closer look, it is rather special and nothing I've seen before. But first, disclaimer time, these prototype units were sent to me for free for this review, but as always, I'm free to give my honest opinions. And spoiler alert, I don't have anything bad to say about these chargers at all after testing them for months. So what makes them special then? Let's get the basics out of the way first. The VN2 system is available for the Canon LPE6, E8 and E17 battery types and for the Sony Camp, the MPFW50. Sadly, at the moment, they don't make one for the Fuji system, which I'm a user, but if they did, one cool feature is that you can actually change the battery plate portion as they are removable, which again is something I've not seen before. You can charge one or two batteries at the same time via the USB Type-C port. From my own test with a LPE6 battery, a single battery took around 2 hours and 40 minutes to charge. And when charging two batteries at the same time, that time increased to about 4 hours and 20 minutes. The VN2 features a clever TCCCCV optimized charging method. What does it all mean? Well, it's a bit technical, but basically it's a better way to charge lithium batteries. That's all we need to know. Moving on. Plus, it has multi-protection for overcharge, over-discharge, temperature sensors, and soft start with zero volts activation for deeply discharged batteries. And of course, it will automatically shut off when fully charged. Instead of a basic display or LED, uh, the VN2 features a very clever LCD display that shows real-time data such as battery temperature, charging voltage, uh, current and capacity at the battery level. Like I said at the beginning of the video, I have never seen this before in any of my other chargers that I've used in the past. So it's really fascinating if you like to nerd out with these kind of uh, stats on the display. If you are interested in finding out more and where you can buy them when available, I'll leave some link down below in the description as always. Additionally, as a bonus for watching till the end, if you are interested in the LPE8, E17 or the FW50 Sony charger, not the LPE6 since I'm using it myself, sorry, let me know down below. I might give it away since I don't have those camera systems, so I don't really need those chargers. And finally, I would like to say thank you to XStar for this review opportunity and thank you for watching my video. My name is Joe and hopefully I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye for now.